Good morning. Hi. Today we're coming to you from a different angle. Mm. See the whole boat. Bit decent dusting. <laughs> oh, like he does the dusting. I do. <laughs> Open the window. <laughs> so, <laughs> yellow warning again today. We've had so much rain, it's raining again now. I just can't see us being out before Christmas, to be no. honest. No, um, and we were just saying yesterday that this time last year, um, we were still going out, weren't we? It was cold. Yeah, we got we lucky. Wrapped up. We were down Kingston shopping and we were getting so nice we even sausage lunch. Yeah, we haven't had a Christmas market or anything yet. No, it's really sad. Anyway, we still have some stuff to impart to our viewers. Yeah. Do we? <laughs> well, enlighten me. <laughs> um, so, still thinking now about condensation. So. Last year we did a video, Man versus Condensation, and we know that the ultimate um, thing that will cure it would be double glazing. No, there's a better cure. There's a better cure. Get a motor on. <laughs> <laughs> you probably get, still get condensation in, in a motorhome. Yeah, but you open the windows and drive. Yeah, true. <laughs> Put the air conditioning on. <laughs> anyway. But, <laughs> But anyway, we yeah we haven't been able to afford double glazing yet. It's really expensive. I think you worked out how much it would be, didn't you, for the whole boat? Yeah, it went up shocking amounts this year when I wanted to buy it, and oh, now really? I can't buy it. Yeah, it's yeah. about three and a half thousand now. Yeah, yeah so, so we haven't got a spare there. three and a half grand yet. It's so like um, kidney. yeah, we've come up with another plan. So we're gonna <laughs> or thing that has worked so far. So we're gonna show you that um, and give you some updates. So here we go. First of all, we're going to give you a little update on our roof from um, last week. Mm. Um, so you used, well, you, you washed it all with boat wash, didn't you? Yeah, jetted it off, cleaned it off, got the muck off. Yeah. And then it was wet and wax. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and um, you said it's actually been quite good because, I mean, it doesn't give a sheen on the boat roof because obviously it's that um, <laughs> matte, sort of. matte paint, yeah, that's non slip. Yeah. Um, but you said that um, trying to then get bird poop off. Yeah, just rinsed it off. Yeah, it's just it just went off. like that, and it just comes straight off. Normally, you have to chisel it off. Don't yeah, you? it's like yeah proper in there, and it? <laughs> it's horrible stuff. But now it yeah, it cleaned off easy. Cleaned off easy. So that's um, mm, yeah, bonus. thumbs yeah. up number one. That did work. So that was good. How long it lasts? I don't know because it's been pouring with rain, hasn't it? I don't yeah. know if it washes off. No. So I guess mm. we'll have to see, won't we? We we'll try it in a couple of weeks. Yeah. <laughs> Trees up. Oh dear. What a depressing <laughs> Christmas isn't it going to be? No. This is our tree from last year. It does look like that actually. And um, it is still alive. I'm not convinced. It is. It's alive. Your, <laughs> your mum said it's alive. And it's brown. She knows it. No, it's just where the sparkly bits have come off. So it's still alive. Got, <laughs> got um, uh, Richard's array of Christmas goodies. So we're on the mince pies and Stalin and um, some nice little chocolates as well, which we took out of um, a decoration little Christmas tree, light up Christmas tree, which is really cute. That's our decorations done. No, we're gonna put some more up. She won't. I've just actually ordered some little hooks for um, fairy lights and uh, on Amazon and used, I mean? yeah, used my um, daughter's account by mistake. <laughs> so she just texted me and said, Oi, buy stuff on your own account. <laughs> you would have seen Lego. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And we went, um, we did a little trip to Costco and um, got this snuggly blanket. Okay, but not only that, let me find the little bit. It's going to take me ages to find a little bit. Ah. Here, can you see? <laughs> you plug it in, and it's a heated blanket, heated throat. So now I can turn the heating off and save the diesel. Yeah, so. You can't move out of the blanket though, because <laughs> the rest of the boat will be minus two. So when we came to the boat on Friday, the, the heating hadn't really warmed, it was 14 degrees, wasn't it? So it wasn't That's like, right. we've had it at five before, but it was 14, popped this on the sofa, sat on it, ooh, 
Nice and toasty. <laughs> should, should have left it at 14. <laughs> Save me money. Oh dear. So, yeah, what was that? About 30 pounds, wasn't it? Yeah. yeah not so, that bad, actually. No, I don't think that was too bad. So, uh, yeah, little Costco trip. I got spoiled. <laughs> yeah, I didn't get nothing. No. Um. Okay, so, um, condensation's always a problem on a boat. Forever. Yeah. Just give up. <laughs> <laughs> and um, our friends who live aboard, they've now got double glazing and they said that it does make a big difference. Massive difference. Yeah, yeah but it's we... just a bit on the frames now. Yeah, say. but we can't afford it yet. Um, it's on our very long list. And if you have a boat, you know that list just gets longer. It's incredible. It doesn't long. ever reduce, does it? No, I look at it and it's frightening, so I just put it away. <laughs> it's like, oh God. <laughs> But, um, so last year we got some um, double glazing film mm. and um, we tested it out, didn't we? We put it on our bow doors and we haven't removed it from our bow doors. It's still on there. It still works. And it works. It's, it's really, good. really good. Yeah. Um, and we tried, we were going to put it on all the Dog. windows. Um, he's, he's gone to bed now. Yeah, he's Again. just gone down. <laughs> um, we were going to try it on all the windows. We did one porthole. And it really worked, didn't it? It does um, work. Yeah. But if we were honest, we couldn't then be bothered to do the rest of the window. It was a faff. Um, yeah, it's a little yes. bit of a faff. We could, I mean, we could have carried on and done it on the portholes, but um, yeah, we didn't. But we know it does, it does, it does work. It does work. Um, the only problem but... is then, obviously, you don't want it on in the summer, so then you have to take it off, which is fine. It comes <laughs> off fine, but it does leave sort of sticky you residue. You've got to get the sticky stuff off, which is a yeah. nightmare. Well, it wasn't... Well, it comes off, but it... you've got to put stuff on it to get it off. Yeah, and, it's and I'm like... quite glad we didn't do all of our windows, because oh that God. would have been like quite a bit of a mission, really, to try yeah. and remove the sticky stuff. But it does work. But it does work. So, yeah, if you, you, know, if you want to do that, then that's great. However, so now we've got our little um, extra thermostat down in the bedroom. That helps control the heating a bit more. Mm. It's made the heating more efficient and equalised the temperature throughout the boat, hasn't it? Yeah, a bit Which better. Which is nice, because you can go to bed without shivering. Yeah, but we <laughs> even um, with that, we still get... It seems to be down... Um, the bow end where the bedroom is, obviously where you're going to sleep and oh, breathing well, in the you're night. There all night and the heating's gone off. Hasn't yeah, it, in exactly. The night. That's where the the major condensation happens. Um, so Richard ordered something, <laughs> and they work. They're not bad. They're, really They're not, not miracles. Bad at all. They're not miracles, but it does cut it down. Yeah, it really does cut it down. So they're designed. Um, These ones for your car. Sit in your car windscreen. So they're basically designed, you put them, yeah, on your dashboard and it stops your windscreen fogging up on the inside. Yeah. So um, Richard thought, well, let's just give them a go um, and ordered some, didn't you, for yeah. the windows. So I'm really cheap. Yeah, um, about £7. Oh, well, yeah, five, it was £20 for four. Yeah. I so thought, we thought, well, we've got nothing to go. lose. We'll give them a go. Um, and... They work, 100%. It was so much better. It was a lot better. There's still condensation. A little bit, but yeah. But nowhere near as much as what we were getting. But a little bit around the frame, as um, whereas before, literally it was, it in the bedroom, it was dripping so much that we were getting a stain underneath the porthole from the amount of condensation. So um, I, well, you put one in the window that way, didn't you? I mean, I lobbed it in and shut the curtains. Yeah, and shut the curtain. <laughs> I don't put anything. I put them I... in that way, um, so they're sort of sat on the windowsill and touching the window. And the one Richard put in that way did work, but not as well as popping it in that way <laughs> for some bizarre reason. Um, so, yeah, and then what happens is it's got a little dot on there. So when that turns pink, um, this is saturated. And then you just pop it in a microwave for six minutes um, and it dries it out again. So even though it has got silica gel in, which isn't great for the environment. I think it is, isn't it? I don't know if yeah. it is. is no, it? I think it is. Um, you're not chucking it away. You're reusing them. So perfect. Yeah. yeah you can put them on a radiator as well. So yeah. So once they turn pink, you can just leave it on a radiator and it will dry. Yeah. So you don't have to put them in a microwave. Yeah. So... Um, 
We'll just show you the portholes. We haven't um, used the cartridge on them. We haven't wiped them or anything, anything have we, this, this morning? Day, no. And we'll show you what they look like. So here we go. This is in our dressing room. So we haven't, we've done nothing <laughs> to this window whatsoever. And you can actually see here where it's completely clear. There's a little bit, look, if I do that, you can see a little bit on the frame but that's pretty much it. We've done nothing to the window, we haven't wiped it, and that's the result. So that, compared to it being dripping wet, literally dripping wet, is an amazing result. It is, and it was cold last night as it well. Was, it was, eight yeah. degrees, and it was damp as well, and yeah. it's been raining all night. And that's actually now gone from blue to white, so I guess it's starting to turn, but that's two mm. nights, so. So I'm now in the bedroom and this is the worst room normally so this is the one where it was all dripping down I'll show you because I can't get the stain off of the wall um, there's still a little bit um, but I have removed um, the little bags but you'll be able to see that it's much much better you just take a moment to appreciate our new window clings <laughs> I love them so this one you can see again there's still a little bit on the frame um, but the window itself is completely clear and you can see how bad it was I think you can see yeah there you go you can see the stain where it was dripping before so yeah definitely I think if I'd left it on this one that'd be dry by now so yeah just a short video really for you today it's really difficult isn't it when um, the river's on yellow and there's not really much to film for you but um we wanted to get it in the stream didn't we we did yeah but um definitely um for the condensation those little bags work an absolute treat we've made it a lot better mm, we've got yeah. it a lot better for We'd, now that'll yeah. do for now for yeah our so i mean <laughs> We would say um, if you want to completely banish condensation, you, you well, you need double glazing. And um, our friends said that they still get a little bit on the rim with double glazing. The frame, you will, yeah, because yeah. they're not thermal break frames. No. So, um, no. If you're having a boat built, then have the double glazing with the thermal break frames, and then yeah. you shouldn't get any condensation. Yeah, it'll be a lot better. Yeah, because when you replace them from single glazing, you've still got the original frames. Yeah. So that's why they you just will... modify them, don't they, so that you can fit the, the glass yeah. in? Yeah, which is good. Um, if you can, better than what you got. If you can be bothered with the faff, then the 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 double glazing film does work. It's good. It does work, but it is yeah a bit of a little bit of a pain to take off. But for us now, at the moment, not being able to afford Actually. double glazing, the little bags for like six seven quid, amazing. Shut curtains and ignore it. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so. So I'll leave far, them open, it yeah, with trying to regulate the heating across the boat and um, and with the little bags, it's a winner winner chicken dinner. <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> <laughs> lost it. Yeah, I know. Mind you, we did floor rowing last night, but I'm, we won't go into that. I'm not putting that video on. No, <laughs> he said to me, I'm going to upload load that to Facebook. I was like, No, I've got no Should makeup have. on, you can't put it on Facebook. <laughs> <laughs> no, you might have to make one of them little gift things out of it. Might do it and put, put a different face on. <laughs> so it might be in this video. <laughs> we'll wait and see. <laughs> anyway, um, if you like this video, give us a little cheeky thumbs up. Um, you can ping that subscribe oh. button. Um, a lot of people think it costs you something to subscribe. It doesn't. No, it's it's free. completely free. Um, and if you yeah. ping the notification <laughs> bell, then YouTube will tell us when uh, another one of our wacky videos is coming out. <laughs> don't yeah. ping it if you don't like you it. Poor people. <laughs> <laughs> or if you want some entertainment. I think we're losing the plot now because we can't go out. So um, there we go. Yeah. And we'll see you next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Do you rowing? <laughs> <laughs>